Hello and welcome to editing top tips on how to become a better editor. Today we will be discussing the main editing points of practice by well-renounced editor Walter Murch. Murch's main points of practice, or more commonly known as the rule of six, consist of emotion, story, rhythm, eye trace, 2D plane of screen and 3D space. These rules can be split by percentages based on their order of importance for an editor to consider when constructing a scene. Emotion taking up over half of the chart with 51%, story getting 23%, rhythm being 10%, eye trace 7%, 2D plane of screen 5% and 3D space only taking up 4%. Merch argues that editors should follow the rule of six to make the best cut possible for their desired outcome. This video will focus on the two most important rules, being emotion and story. It was an attempt to answer the question, in some ideal, let's say even platonic world, what is a perfect cut from one shot to another? You have to keep your fingers on that emotional pulse as an editor and not really ever let it go. Using these rules as a guide, we can examine how information is revealed to the audience. Thus, the intended viewing experience is altered purely by the different ways a scene can be edited. Let's take this for example. A woman enters a room and then is suddenly taken by surprise as the camera cuts to show a dead body lying on the floor. With the scene edited in this way, the viewer experiences the shock factor of her surprise before then fully understanding what causes her reaction, thus creating a feeling of confusion to realization, followed by shock for the viewer. In contrast to the viewer seeing the body in the first scene, followed by them watching the actor approach the room and then discovering the body that the viewer already knows is there. This technique of hindsight builds suspense and tension, with the viewer feeling dread and empathy for the woman and what she is about to discover. And finally, this scene could be shown through the woman's point of view. This can be achieved with the woman entering the room in the first scene, with the camera then cutting to the dead body and eventually back to the woman to finally show her shocked reaction to the viewer. This editing technique allows the audience to experience the shock of the body reveal at the exact same time the character does. I hope these examples have given you an insight into how utilising Walter Murch's top two techniques of editing can control how and at what point the information is given to the viewer, therefore manipulating emotion and impact. Thank you for watching.